Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Wavy and this is just Wavy Media. And if you're a returning subscriber, it's been a long time since I've made a video, so you're welcome back. If you guys don't know Alan, but you will. This Hello. is Alan. Hi, Alan. Um, <laughs> we are in the airport. You probably recognize this spot because I've filmed from here before. Because we're going to go to LA. So we have LA 2024 videos. I will link the playlist above. This is going to be the first one of them, so there's going to be nothing on it yet. But uh, it'll be there. So come with us yeah. on our adventure. Hey guys, so we have finally gotten to uh, our hotel, our first hotel, after a lot, a lot of travel. But we're finally here, so it's exciting. Uh, I'm gonna turn the camera around and show you guys the room so you, you can see it. They've done a really cool, you can kind of see a peek of it there, <laughs> um, with the towels, which are really nice. Putting a Motel 6 was gonna do fancy towel stuff. Yeah, that is super fancy. But they did. So I'll turn the camera around and show you. So that's a car door. It's an actual hotel, it's not a motel, even though it's called a motel city. Because it's got corridors. That's a corridor out there. It's not like leading straight outside. And we've got like this walk-in wardrobe space here. And then into the bathroom, which has a shower bath and a toilet. Great. Just what you need. And then we've got like desk space, big TV, a giant massive California king bed, which I always love having. You can roll the whole way across it and not fall off. And here's the really cool towels that they did for us. The two little swans. How lovely is that? And we've got a massive fridge in this one too. Like, it is the size of an at-home fridge. So we can stock that up with fizzy drinks and water and milk for breakfast cereal. And there's a microwave we can use downstairs, so that'll be great too. And obviously we've got air conditioning and I've already got it turned on. So it is the first evening, and the first day, and where we put in and out. And Alan is soon going to have his first ever in and out. So you're all going to have the wonderful experience of getting to see how he, what he thinks of it. Be it could be disappointing. We'll see. <laughs> <laughs> I got a protein style double double. I love that they do this. We'll see what Alan thinks of burgers in a second. No, no pressure. All of California will hate you if you don't like it. That's that's the only thing. I'll edit out your chewing. Don't worry. <laughs> it's a burger. <laughs> After in and out we went to Target and got some stuff for the hotel and of course I had to get lucky charms um, but these ones apparently reveal dragons in the milk so that sounds like fun. We got milk too obviously. And now we're gonna go to Scum and Villainy and have some fun themed cocktails. <laughs> Okay, so it's very loud in here and you're probably not going to be able to hear us, but we are in Scotland Villainy. And this is blue milk with a blue lightsaber. Fantastic pork base with rosemary that is set on fire. Oh, yeah. I have to blow it out before walking back. <laughs> How does it taste? I don't know what that's like. Uh, 
Good morning and welcome to day two of our 2024 trip to LA. Uh, this is just a continuation from what you saw last night. It's coming to me because there's not enough content for a whole video from yesterday. So today uh, is a new day. Uh, it is 15 degrees, which is great because it was super cold in Ireland. And that was why I planned for this trip to be in January. Because I couldn't do it the whole of winter again. Um, so yeah, today we're going to do a bus tour around LA and I'm gonna hop on, hop on one. So uh, I'll take you along and we'll see what we see as we go along to LA. You're not gonna be able to hear the stuff because it's in the phones, but uh, we'll tell you about things as we go along and see what we see. I'm also gonna go to a place that is a, a this is the plan anyway, hopefully we get there, it is a Korean-Mexican fusion restaurant. So I am looking forward to that. And we also plan to go to the Brea Targets today as well. Um, which will be exciting, I've never been there before. Um, both myself and Alan have been watching La Brea on Paramount Plus. Um, so yeah, we're kind of excited to see where, what, what inspired that story. But now, for right now, it's time for a little bit of break. What you guys know is Lucky Charms. I'm excited, I haven't had these for so long. They're getting really hard to find in Ireland now. This is hard to do with one of I'm excited. It's so excited. I'm like a child. Look at me with my children's breakfast cereal. But I'm also a cliche because I'm Irish and I like Lucky Charms. But it isn't true. They are deli magically delicious. Well. Here is Alan with a bird of paradise flower. These are my favorite flowers. What did you do, Alan, for my birthday? Crocheted birds of paradise flower. And how did they come out seeing them in person? Spot on. <laughs> they really did. He did a great job.
Hello everybody, we've just gotten off the first part of the bus tour that we did today. Uh, so we saw some of Hollywood, West Hollywood, and Sunset Strip, and we're now in Beverly Hills. Um, so we're going to go walk down Rodeo Drive after this, and there's a chocolate shop off the corner of it that I'll have to find on Google Maps. And we'll go and buy probably like a $5 chocolate each, um, just to say we've bought something on Rodeo Drive. So I think that would be fun. What do you think of Beverly Hills? Ah, it's funny. <laughs> <laughs> I like the whole like uh, on the tour being like, oh, celebrities, they're just like us, and then it's like, and then they have their own like personal individualized tree landscapes and like different color fire hydrants and shit. <laughs> oh, I probably shouldn't hear it. That's Sorry. Okay. It's fine. <laughs> Say whatever you want. Here we are, Rodeo Drive. Around the home. A lot of things that we can't afford. <laughs> Yay! Anson's chocolate here on Rodeo Drive. Because, well, it's just on Rodeo Drive. Because we're poor and we can't buy Rodeo Drive things. So we've got a $4 chocolate. <laughs> and a box of chocolates, too. It's cute. I'm showing the box without spilling a chocolate. Try the one that's individual. So Alan is having a honey and hibiscus chocolate. Mm. It is really good. <laughs> Does it taste like honey? Yeah. It's like honey and like I'm assuming hibiscus, but like what is that? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it is really good. I would recommend it. Mine is a peppermint truffle. But with, there's some of the exciting ones I have too, but this is a boring one. It just didn't fit in the box, so I can buy it separately, so I'm gonna eat that one. Oh wow, pretty nice. Over here. So the outside of it is kind of biscuity almost. And then the inside, bottom is mint and top is truffle. Or I turned it upside down to show it to you, but I'm looking at it the other way. It's really good. I really like that. I don't know if it's four dollars. Good, but it's nice. We are in Santa Monica at the minute in a Mexican place called Holy Guacamole, which is a really cool new world of God giving us tacos. Which yes, I think that's so true. But uh, they have panchada here, which Alan has never had before, so he's gonna try some panchada to see if he likes it. It's a good one, so it's okay for him to try. That's really nice. Yeah. That's really good and I really like it. Alan's first time at the Pacific Ocean. <laughs> He's gonna touch the Pacific Ocean for the first time. <laughs> it's okay, Dickie. <laughs> I 
you're gonna like walk down to it to touch it and it'll be a big one that'll come like right up to me. So we've done the bus tour and things haven't gone as according to plan as we would have liked. We stopped in Santa Monica, you've seen that, but we didn't manage to get to La Brea Tower Pits or to that Asian or that Korean Mexican fusion place. But now we are in the Chinese theater uh, and we're gonna go see the Mean Girls musical. So we're excited for that. Um, we'll look at the Chinese theater. I'll show you the other way properly. It looks so good. Cool. It looks like over there. That there's some sort of event on because there's like popcorn and drinks and I'm not here but there's like also a security thing Cupcake vending machine <laughs> Living in the future We are They actually call it an ATM though <laughs> That would have been violent. <laughs> yes. Now go get Mike. <laughs> 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 vending machine cupcakes to see what they're like. Um, I'll put down the camera now in a second while I open it because I don't know if I can do it. Alan's gonna help. You did a good job though. You got, you got the sticker thing open. <laughs> I can grab that because like, it's much in the frosting all over your hands. It's much frosting all over my hands. So mine is a red velvet and it looks like a boob. <laughs> it is very nipple like. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I got sprinkles. From sprinkles? From sprinkles. The place is called sprinkles. Probably not the best thing to do with that. Be fine. Cheers. Cheers. Cake cheers. Mm. That's so much frosting. <laughs> There's a lot of frosting. I mostly have frosting. <laughs> Me too. But it's nice. Mm. The frosting's nice too. Yeah. It is actually, for someone who isn't a frosting person, it's nice. Yeah. I like the little freckles of like this coloring. It looks like it's got sprinkles through the, mm. like the batter. Mm. Mm. That's cool. Mm. It does. It has sprinkles through the batter. It does. It's very cool. It is. I feel like everything would color very well to draw me. If I try and bake sprinkles and honey, then you just kind of go for us color. <laughs> <laughs> because we're in America and the artificial coloring is in there between me and the Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna fight from the cakey bit. Oh. 